finally a day that wasn't raining it was so nice outside we finally got to get to silver springs state park you walk in and you see this beautiful bridge wouldn't these be great for family pictures that's all i could think when i was walking in Because of the rain, we did not make reservations because we didn't want to have to move them around. It's a very easy walk into the rental area after you pay your $2 per person. I think we paid about $60 for two hours on a canoe which held three people. I got to be passenger princess, so I did all the videoing and made sure everyone had water and snacks. she gave us had us going against the current going out and coming in with the current we decided to go the opposite way and here's where it opens up there's glass bottom boats you can pay to tour in i'm not quite sure of the prices i don't remember it being too expensive this park opened at eight o'clock so they were starting tours and canoe rentals right when we got there but look at this water it's so blue it's so clear y'all it was just beautiful and here we are with a gator friend he was the first of five gators that we saw we got a little too close to him he hissed at us so we went away real quick the only thing about the map that they gave us to follow is it really didn't tell you what you were going to see along the path i have no idea what those structures were i swear the lady said there was a movie set what movie it was i don't know i could have totally misheard her my husband said he wishes we would have done the eight hour canoe and just been out there all day it was so nice so comfortable he was so relaxed it was the best father's day he said we got there this place was not packed when we left tons of cars so I totally recommend getting there first thing in the morning now this is how close this state park was from where we were camping there's the exit to the camp the state park and there's the sign for the campground we were at so close and the pros we got there right when it opened finally it was beautiful cost was nominal rental price prices were reasonable and it was super close to where we were staying cons we should have booked a rental long longer there was no swimming allowed in the river and there was really no place to stop and eat if you had taken a longer canoe rental thanks for watching hope you guys visit let us know what you think